Okay, Kobe Manu is per 90 stats. Can you see all reds? I can't see it, bro. I am choosing to not see it. Uh, I love how nobody has said Anthony. I was gonna say, he's, like, he's not rated by anyone. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> the club that we love to love and love to hate, uh, Manchester United. Kobe Manu. <laughs> that is just hate. <laughs> right answer. Okay, what is, what, the def- is what is the definition of overrated? Literally, so Kobe Manu is... People think he is good, but he's not good. That's it. People think he's way too no, no, no. good and he's good. Yeah. Is what the definition yeah. is. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have stats to back my argument. I can send the stats on WhatsApp or I can email them to you. Just I, can, a hater, I can physically... I, I cannot... I have, I can I can what show you stats. Okay, Kobe Manu is per ninety stats. Can you see all reds? I can't see it, bro. I am choosing to not see it. Can you see all the reds? That is. I mean, I would say I would say one stat though. Like for being a defensive or a midfielder, he has had passes 35, com- 40 touches per game. Passes completed 30, 31 percentile, thirty three per ninety. Passes attempted twenty three percentile, which is. Disgusting. Total passes, passing distance, twenty-two. Anyway, he's a really. He's you a have player. to also take into account the kind of team and the style of play yes, that yes, is being played under the team. I agree. Look, so I think he's a yeah. he's a really good but player. But Kobe Manu has... also has hundred percent pass accuracy over the last three or four games. Mm. Just saying. Yeah, he's good. No, he's not a bad player. He's up. coming up. He's like how like yeah. he's gonna get to the level of like you know Saka, Bellingham. Maybe if his development is right. He can get there, but at this point, he's like, I mean, it's United. Yeah, he's taking games. People are telling, people are shouting out for him to start with Rice and Bellingham in the England midfield. Come on, dude. He literally, (laughs) like, last season he was studying, bro. But, like, (laughs) he's giving exams. Bro, he he, he is the first, like, I think, first player in a while to, like, skip the under 21s and directly go to the England squad. So, okay. I mean, if you're using that as a reason to call him overrated, I mean, sure, but I don't agree with it. Before we continue further, if you're enjoying the content, please leave a comment and tell us your favorite part of the video. Don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. We have loads of such things lined up and we're excited to share it with you. Why do you think he should start for England then? He should start for England because given his age and the kind of maturity he's playing with he does i mean i don't think he should start you for exactly him, for said England, the reason why he no, should no, no. start he, age and maturity he should, he should he should come on as a sub at 18 it's not right for him to start for england for any player to start for england at 18 uh, he, nobody should go through that amount of pressure at this age but he he has shown so much potential at such a young age that and he's he has not made any mistakes he has saved united's ass multiple times already in the last three or four months. So I don't think he is overrated at all. Sorry. I actually can see a lot of parallels. Be... I can see a lot of parallels from when Saka just started out. Um, there was a point when Arsenal was literally in the ditch and Saka would come on and he was the only glowing hope. Like he would save Arsenal. Yeah. Emery got him. Also, a lot of parallels between Emery, Arsenal and Ten Hag uh, uh, United. I feel like you will yeah. find your Arteta soon. You need to find your Arteta soon. But, uh, yeah, but I see a lot of parallels. So, at that point in time, Saka, I think, initially probably wasn't as rated as Kobe Manu is now. Just because, like, you know, United have been starving. So, uh, I guess, mm. for me, this is the definition of overrated. I'm not saying he's a bad player at all. I think he'll be turn out to be really good. But I'm saying people are, like, pushing him too forward right now. Then they should. All right. SNT. Yeah, well, yeah I... He's only played 11, 11 games and the hype is just too much. But we've had someone else on this, okay. on this, in this club for so long and hasn't been doing much. So I think that guy is the overrated guy. <laughs> Marcus, he <laughs> carried you through the last season. Come on, have some shame. I mean, it's fine. I mean, I guess, dude, I'm hearing rumors that there's like 70, 80 million bid. I'm saying take it. Like, just yeah, bro. Take it. Easy. Too many attackers. Tell him like, off. You can. You can figure something out. We need the money. We don't. We can't spend any more money. We are fucked. Like we need. We have so much riding on the last 10-11 games. It's not even funny. Like we don't have any money. Re- regulators are cracking down on like spending and like the club structures and everything. So if we are getting 80 million, sell it. 
because if someone's willing to pay 80 million for rashford you should just take it bro like yep yeah big guess I mean, to I'm that for that for 80 million anyway uh, i love how nobody has said antony i was going to say like, he is not rated by anyone yeah. exactly yeah. <laughs> you can say so many players um, that way but they're not yeah, rated yeah. So who, no 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 they're not or, he's not rated who's or, um, or i would I would have said Rashford, but since SNT stole my answer, I'll say Casemiro. Bichara. Casemiro is spent. Yeah, yeah, he's spent. Yeah, I mean, like he, the amount of money we got him for, and I mean, he was go- he had a very good first season. He was probably one of the best players, but like he's just done, and that's not how you like. That's not the standards you are supposed to play at when you play at United. So I I don't think another Ford, signing uh, yeah. Ten Hag vetoed He's by done. the way. Ten Hag did not want to sign Casemiro by the way initially. It's just yeah. because of all the mismanagement and all that shit. Hmm. Same okay, for gonna... Anthony by the way, but yeah. Right. I'm going to use my powers and I'm going to say Manu definitely is the most overrated player in in United. Arsenal hate <laughs> some You cannot some... stand another player better He's than Rice. O- overrated some right now. Terrible. See, this is how this is why it's overrated yeah. because you're saying cool, it's better cool, than Rice cool. already. This I mean, everyone overrates their players, dude. It's 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 very sure. natural. So that's why we're like putting them putting it out there. Like, 